This is the most dangerous hotel in the world. Standing right in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean, 100 feet up in the air. I have no idea why someone would build this or even visit it. And then there's me. I'm staying there tonight. Okay, now we have to somehow get there. Now this hotel is completely surrounded by sharks. Mina, there's a shark, watch out! It's constantly hit by hurricanes, so the whole thing could literally just collapse at any moment. And it's over 35 miles from any land! That's the only way on and off, and there's a ride, so now we're stuck here. <laughs> you guys remember Manuel, right? Hi guys, I'm uh, back. Manuel is absolutely terrified of the ocean. Perfect person to take here. Between us, Manuel can't swim. I can so hear you. He actually almost drowned last week. I'm enjoying the view so far. Hopefully we don't get in the water. That's not happening. I'm not getting in the water, Peter. I'm making him get I'm in the not. water. Manuel and I are stranded here for the next 50 hours, and our goal is for us to face and overcome all of our fears. But what really makes this the world's most dangerous hotel? This is Richard. You basically I run the whole hotel, right? Yeah, well, I try and make it so that you guys don't die. Try. Yeah, sometimes uh -huh. I can't. <laughs> okay, okay, Jill. Yeah, Alright, come on in through our okay. storm door. We're gonna go up 50 steps up to the very top. Yo, look how high. We're 126 feet up, but why don't we go oh, up man. further? Ready? Um, are we? <laughs> Richard! Oh my gosh. I think you're gonna need some help repairing this. Come on up. You are 136 feet above the ocean. Up here, you've got the wind turbines. We have clocked 105 miles an hour on that one right there. Wait, is that from the hurricane? Yeah. Are you afraid of like... Dying? dying? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're not coming up here? No. The only thing I'm scared of is the water. Like, I'm gonna be honest. Well, that's because we're gonna put you in it. Some You're of the not. sharks do like to come up and do a test bite, like bull sharks or great whites. We had one come right past the camera last year. What have I gotten myself into? Come on, man. Well, you can do it. Thank God I'm <laughs> out of there. So you know the tower is okay to go in because uh, the green light's flashing green, so we're good. If it flashes red, run like hell. If someone falls in the water mm -hmm. or someone gets really hurt, just walk yeah. over here, someone goes... <laughs> Oh my god. And everybody comes running. What's going on? What are you <laughs> oh yeah, you're probably wondering who these people here are. They're volunteering to help fix the tower. Because like I said, this thing is completely falling apart. So when you're on the tower, if you have to get off, like right now, there's only one way to do that. You could head out the escape door right here. Oh my god. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. Check it out. So we're in the belly of the beast right now. This is the ugly undergarments. We are 65 feet above the water. So we just let you down here. Oh my god. Kind of falling apart there. This is so scary. <laughs> Another thing that's interesting about the tower is that they built it to last 50 years. And it has been 70 years. Yeah, definitely did the math wrong, but the tower is still way past its lifespan. We learned it was built in the early 60s to warn ships because so many would sink here. And just when we thought it couldn't get any more dangerous, I can stick <laughs> my fingers right through that piece of I beam. Oh, look, I'm bending oh, the I beam. Okay. Also, the one that you guys are standing on right there. Uh. It's completely <laughs> rotted out. Okay. Okay, let's, let's back up a little bit. So then, I could like literally like, oh, watch out, watch out. So I was definitely convinced this is the most dangerous hotel out there, but there was still one thing I needed to find out after getting to know Richard. Why would someone want to own and run this place? And also, what are we gonna eat? Ah! Uh, full in. Oh, I see Oh it. my God. Oh, big man, bring him up. Uh, woo. <laughs> I'm a little behind. Look at that. Uh, we eat. That's our dinner. Yeah. I haven't eaten here yet. Uh -huh. Eat me now. <laughs> eat me. Uh. Yeah. I've never seen the sunset on the water in my whole life. I was actually really looking forward to this. You know what this means, right? Kiss. <laughs> I think we're avoiding going in the water. I'm not going in the water. <laughs> All right, well, uh, power just went out. <sighs> you can't even see you. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie though, it gets really cold here. I mean, one light came back. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> it's just me and Dark. Well, we're gonna see what happens. All right, finally got the power working for now because literally the only thing around us is just water. I can see every star in the sky right now. Oh my gosh. After watching the stars, our food was ready. We had a nice family dinner and then Richard had a surprise for us. Oh my. Oh. 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 I guarantee you there's people over in that boat going, what the <laughs> I'm Jake Paul, and you're watching Disney Channel. <laughs> <laughs>
we're about to head to sleep tomorrow. It's gonna be uh. Oh gosh, yeah, very big day. You don't want to miss it. Oh, one thing, we actually thought there was gonna be internet here, but it's not working, dude. It's like we're on a different planet. I recommend it. No internet. Try it. All right. Well, time for bed. We still have thirty something more hours. <laughs> Good night, guys. <sighs> Good morning. Quick little room tour. You literally can't tell we're in a very dangerous hotel. I mean, there's a picture right there, but it almost seems normal and completely safe until you look over here. You can literally see the ocean from here and the whole thing could definitely collapse. That's why there's a raft right here. Hey guys. Yeah, somehow these guys convinced me to exercise with them and I was actually starting to enjoy myself. Maybe Richard was onto something when he bought this. What made you decide to buy this hotel, fix it up, and do all of this crazy stuff? I think the viewers really wanna know. I bought my childhood tree house. The one that I had in the backyard when I was a kid. <laughs> this is it. Put in a bid and I won it for 11 grand. I didn't even know anyone could own something like this. Yeah. Now it was time to go down into the ocean. But as soon as we were about to get suited up, the weather got really bad we are in the middle of the ocean this is probably the most windy i've ever felt in my life dude that is so scary richard was very against us going into the ocean the wind was forming massive waves and a deadly current we honestly almost gave up on it but there was no way we came all the way out here for manuel not to conquer his fear we had to do this all right manuel i think it's time look at this i feel like a, I feel like a superhero you look like an idiot what? I also look like an idiot. <laughs> Dude, we're doing this in the middle of January too. The coldest time of the year. What are we doing? Are you ready? No, man. <laughs> I ain't ready. Yeah, you're actually so... Uh, you look like... Yeah, really yeah what the f***? I'm nervous. I'm about to like be in the middle of the ocean. It's scary too. I'm going yeah, first. Not Peter. <laughs> Holy sh Oh my god. I'm really going into shark infested water right now. Oh my god. Holy sh I am terrified right now. Yo, he's so still. We're just fishing here, man. Oh god, I'm literally in the middle of the ocean. It's okay, I'll be fine. I'm not, I'm a good swimmer. That's a lie. I'm not a good swimmer. Why did I sign up to do this? I'm in the water. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm in the water. Oh my god. Oh no, man. I'm staying right here. I'm staying sitting down. I'm gonna sound like a right now but i'm gonna stay right here how you doing i'm doing great yeah <laughs> holy sh i'm so terrified dude that current is no joke i'm not gonna lie dude i'm not leaving this chair yes you are i'm not leaving this chair oh, oh god oh god the current oh god all right i think you can pull me up now if you want only if you want to oh thank god i'm leaving this oh god thank god I'm so happy I'm alive. I swear I swim like a mile, right? Yeah. <laughs> that was so scary, bro. I was just laughing the entire time. Really? Yeah, because I can't cry on camera. <laughs> so I was proud of Manuel. He did conquer his fear, but he did not go all the way into the water. And now that was gonna be up to me. Hi, right, Peter. Have fun, man. How much did they pay? Okay, this part is free. It only costs to come back up. What does it cost? Dude! Oh my. This is so much bigger than I thought it would be. Oh no no! Oh my God! Oh, the water is so. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. I'm good, dude. I'm just in the middle of the ocean, dude. I'm holding on. Peter, cut the rope. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! I can't hear you. It's okay. I'll tell you when you get up here. <laughs> I'm holding on for dear life. Oh, I'm going all the way in. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is literally a shark. Five feet away from him. I really hope there's no shark. Probably thinks it's just like swimming. There's nobody around them. You guys see any fish? No, we didn't see any fish. Oh my god. I see why no one's ever done it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Did you see the shark, Peter? No. Yeah, he's bigger than you, dude. Wait, actually? He's not believing us. Yeah, it? yeah, he's not. It's the actual shark. No, there was actually. It was like five feet away from you. I was scared for you. The ocean's oh, such a scary place. <laughs> the ocean. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> that was so wild. That was great. He still doesn't believe that was a shark. No, I, I literally don't believe away it. From the rope got tangled. Yeah, I would have freaked out and died. <laughs> <laughs> After spending 50 hours here, I actually had a ton of fun. Everybody should face their fears, whether that's the ocean, heights, darkness, who knows? You might end up having one of the most memorable experiences of your life in a good way. Well, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, y'all. Or we might not make it back.